It's an unprecedented trial in Mauritania. Former President Mohamed Ould Abdelaziz in court over corruption charges. After serving his two terms, he stepped down and handed over power in 2019, a first in a country accustomed to military coups. The start of the trial drew a crowd on Wednesday, some demanding that justice be served and others expressing their support for the former president. My reaction is that the trial will be unfair, that the rights of the defense will not be respected and that it will not be a fair trial. The trial is taking place in a very open atmosphere. Some of the speeches have been very intense, but it's the least one can expect from a trial like this. There have been several incidents on the part of our colleagues in the defense. The night before he was due in court, Ould Abdelaziz took to Facebook to defend his record as president. Faced with these false and misleading accusations, I will defend myself. I will defend my honor and my dignity, and beyond that, I will defend the rights of the Mauritanian people who deserve justice. I will remain standing against this destructive regime. He was referring to the government led by Mohamed Ould al Ghazwani, his former right hand man and defense minister. He'd actually backed Ghazwani's candidacy in 2019. The former president now stands accused of illegally amassing a personal fortune worth millions of dollars during his 11 years in power, with fingers in several pots, including state contracts and real estate. He has repeatedly denied the charges. According to the lawyers, the trial could last weeks or even months.